We should be online any second now. Oh, I don't hear anything. Well, I don't need it. Oh, stream health, not good. Great. That's great. Ah, Jesus. Okay. Oh no! Hello guys, the Walking Dead. Yay! It's the Walking Dead. It's the Walking Dead. As you saw in the intro, it's it's definitely Walking Dead. Wait, I have to, I have to. This is my German. My, do you, they even hear us? I don't think. Guten Tag. Uh, yeah, do you hear us? That's, that's a problem. Probably not. That's a problem. That's probably right the now. good thing. Um, hello, hello. What's going on? Wait. Do I need that? Uh, yeah. <laughs> okay, you do hear us. That is actually great. I'm scarred for life after that. Thank you. That was not a harmony. You mean I in a, think in it was a, a harmony. With a positive. Was it? I don't know. We we'll hear you. Okay, awesome. that's good. Oh, yeah. Yeah. We can hear you. Amazing. That's one thing that I can never. No, this will forever be on the internet. Delete from my life. CP will take care of it. I know that. <laughs> so we won't delete this. What is happening? Why is this no. not green? If that's not green, I'm not happy. Positive, of course. That's what I like to hear. Hello, hi. Uh, yeah, we are not prepared at all. We have no music <laughs> background. We have nothing. Do you guys see us properly? Does it buffer? <laughs> Does it do anything? Yeah, we just thought. Hey. We're going to do a live Q&A because we don't have that many questions. So we thought maybe you guys will ask some live. That'd be so cool. And maybe AMC will join us. Maybe Skybound will join us. And they will all ask questions. Probably, the, right? That's the yeah. goal. Seid ihr beide Deutsch? No, we're both Deutsch. <laughs> yeah. that, that well spoken. Perfect. Well said. Oh, yeah. Do we uh, have music in the background? Yeah. We would have, but no. Okay, wait. Uh, can we can we do some music? Sure. Some like copyright f f free music. Free music. Is there any copyright free music still on YouTube? <laughs> I don't think. Now so. that I mean, uh, you is gone. I mean, the article thirty is gone. Yes, there is. Oh yeah, right. But not for long, probably. We're on easy street. I don't know the words. On a scale of 0 to 10, how amazing is Negan's lean? Oh, it's amazing. <laughs> this is so good. Like, there was never a more perfect lean than Negan's lean. It, I mean, I mean it. It's amazing. No, not Easy Street. Why not? Why? It's a perfect song. <laughs> oh, this is so going to be copyrighted. I think it was copyrighted like five seconds. We just used five seconds of the yeah. song. And it was Bam, copyrighted. Gone. So we had to like really cut it so weird that it's not. We did it. Somehow. I don't know how oh, you yeah. did it. Uh, let's go. Copyright free music. Apocalypse. <laughs> yeah, of course. There would definitely be some. Yeah, that's what I used. The first one. Ooh. Yeah, that, that one? Yeah, that's uh, what I used for the outro. Oh, was it? No, no, it was not. That was from Last of Us. That was from Last of Us. I mean, it's... Background music. Post apocalypse mix. Yeah, I'm not really... Oh, Jesus. Oh, we're still going to get copyrighted. Guys, yay! Uh-huh. I can't scroll down. Why not? What the this fuck? Is, oh, God. This is not going to be good. The stream is not going to be available, probably. Hi Nowhere. Guys, how are you? Gone. <laughs> like like you see, we're always prepared. <laughs> we're always prepared. Where's the music, man? Did I miss when they would say season eight reactions begin? What? Next no, week. you didn't miss anything. It was f we we're four minutes in. Tutor, hey, hi. Season What's eight up? reactions will begin as soon as possible. I think. Uh, I hope. Maybe this week. Well, no, but this week. Not probably. Maybe. What? Maybe I will do one one this week. Even well, though normally you're being generous, man. Normally it doesn't, but I love this show so much, and I actually want to just continue watching. God, well, that's, true. that's so good. That's so good. True. Hello. By the way, guys, I just right in in the in the title, I mean people. I hope people know it and they're not stupid. Spoilers, from one to seven. I don't even know why 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 we would say that, but in case you didn't know that in a Q and A there will be spoilers, there will be. 
I'm not going to write that. Don't you dare that. spoiler. Don't you dare spoiler. We have Sheepy here. She will, like, ban you instantly. Sheepy. I have to tell you that you guys look amazing today. Yes, only today. Well, at least once in a lifetime. I'm happy. Thank you. I'm happy. Thanks. Uh, which early character would you say miss? You miss. Oh, who are you? Who do I miss? Oh, God. Early character. Actually. Shane would be good. I mean, miss. Oh, yeah. Yeah. Shane. Um, Herschel, of course. Oh, Herschel always. Like, the earliest was Shane, definitely. Mm. I, I do miss T-Dog. I think he would, would have gr had a great, like, evolution throughout all this. And uh, just like the way he he would be right in this moment, like with Negan and everything. Yeah, I would, exactly. I would love to see that. Of course, Glenn in the Negan situation, but he would, he you know, it was just this season, so I don't know. Exactly. That's really... <sighs> Okay, wait, what, what, what's going on? Mark and Ellie just finished season 7. They're not up to date. Yes, this is season 7 Q&A. Not, we're not, you know. Yeah, thanks for the warning. Don't, please Be don't careful, talk about guys. season 8 or season 9 or season 10. No, season, wh where are we right now? 7. No, no I we're going to start with 8. No, where is season, you know, wh where is it like a. Right now? What, what is starting? 9, isn't it? 9 or 10? I, I don't know. Okay, don't 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 answer. I want to know. What do you think will die in season eight? And uh, season what? In season eight? Where are you? <laughs> oh. I think. Well, this is. I don't know. I I'm mean, not... season seven really ended on a good. Yeah. I no, think, I no think, one died I think, really. I think uh, one of the. Bix is going to die. And I don't think Rick. I think uh, Negan, uh, King Ezekiel, or Maggie. You know? Hmm. I think one of these three are going to die. Um, I think if anyone it would be King Ezekiel. Oh, please, no. Oh, oh please, not Shiva. No, Shiva has to survive, man. She just runs off to the wi wilderness and she lives yeah, there true. happily ever after. But would she, uh, I don't, yeah, yeah, I don't think... Nah. If, if she, she, if she, she dies, then no, from no, humans, no, no, no. probably. Yeah, of but, course. Yeah. Oh, please don't. Nah. No, oh, here was a question. Uh, how have you guys been avoiding spoilers? If you have, that is. Uh, it's not difficult, really. I mean, I, I got some spoilers, and I think he was spoiled sometimes um, throughout, like, in, in Season 7. He knew about Glenn and everything. Um, so it wasn't that easy. But I actually haven't been spoiled, and I'm pretty active on social media and everything for Season 8 or Season 9. Not at all. Oh, I know that Rick's leaving. Yeah, that's what I don't I mean. know. Yeah, that's or what dying. I, mean. I don't know what. Yeah, exactly I don't know what, but he's not in. He's not in season. What? Okay, I don't know. I don't know a lot, but I know he's leaving, and I hate it. I hate it so much. Let's see. Um, I feel that Shane and Negan would have been interesting together. Oh yeah, oh yeah. I think he would have actually joined with him. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. You're you're making sense, man. That's cool. But Shane. I'm on your side. A, Let's kill Rick. Yeah, no, Shane is just a great character. I think with Laurie dead, I think he would actually be siding with Rick, and he would be like the, the, like the total badass on on Rick's. Yeah. You know. Oh, that would be so cool to see. The henchman. Would Shane be. would beat the shit out of Nick. Oh yeah, he would. Ah, so so sad. Shane would be great in this season and in the next. Hmm. Ah, T Dog has had had a good moral compass with a good dose of badass. Yeah. Like, Definitely. it was a good mixture. Definitely, yeah. What about Dale? Yeah, Dale. Yeah. I also thought about it, I, but... I, I actually thought about him, but... Shane over Wade, you yeah, know. Yeah, I don't think he would have survived anything in this season. Yeah. Like, he was all about moral. Back, he was all about good. Back being, then, being good, it was peaceful, man. Being human. Now it's... He couldn't. It's, in this, it's, in this it's, season, he would have... He either killed go in, himself. Yeah, he, he would have either go insane, killed himself, or he would have gotten himself yeah. killed. Um, how do you think the war is gonna end up? Ugh. I think I, I hope. Think... I actually hope the war between Negan and Drake is gonna end in season eight. Somehow. The music, man. <laughs> <laughs> it's Bangladesh. Eh? Oh yeah. I hope it's gonna because I think three seasons would be too much. Yeah, but war. yeah, yeah, um, yeah. Yeah. I mean, I do know some things about the the comics, so. 
I can think of something, but I don't think that they are going to do it because they changed a lot in the comics mm. and in the show too. So, um, we're at nine B right now. Okay, that's awesome. Sparta coming. Rick is gay. You think that Daryl was right to trust Dwight in the finale? Seems like Negan is not keeping Dwight up to date with everything. Uh, I think when it comes to reading people, I think Daryl is one of the best. You think that Daryl was right he knows, to trust Dwight? He knows good, he knows evil, and he he's been shit, through yeah. everything, exactly. so I think, uh, yeah. Mm. I think he, 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 he was right. I think Dwight really changed, and he saw that. Second, yeah. Hi, Kine, uh, are that is true. I would like to know that. Why is Negan not keeping uh, Dwight up to date? I think it's nothing personal or anything. It's really just a uh, decision that... Yeah. I think Negan doesn't tell anyone, everyone, anything. Mm. Everyone, everything. Yeah. I mean, he has his people yeah. that he turns to to like sit, uh, different situations, I mm. think. And I think when it comes to a dirty job or something, I think then uh, he's the man. Yeah. When it comes to business and everything, isn't Simon like his? Yeah, exactly. I, I think, right? His right hand. Yeah. Simon probably knows a lot or everything. Yeah, because did we ever see uh, Dwight collecting things on his own without Negan or... No, he never was there, right? Mm -hmm. There was always Simon or Negan, personally. Yeah. So I think I can see why. Q and A are a good exercise to train English. Perfect for me. Yeah. Well, Sasha actually died. <laughs> true. Yeah. True. St why didn't we s we say it? We said it right. Like we would. No, I said uh, no one, no major character died. But yeah, yeah, Sasha was a major, definitely. Um. Yeah. I don't know why I forgot about her. She. Uh, the whole know, thing was weird. I don't know. We never really cared about Sasha. But, yeah, uh, it's, it also this, plays a role. The, the way she died was great. So well executed, mm. I think. I think was very... She, yeah, they, they made me feel for her. And that's crazy. Yeah, well, it was a great episode. Very, very good. So where are we? Oh, jeez. Uh, who do you think could would win in a hand-to-hand -hand fight? The governor or Negan? Hand-to-hand. Hand-to-hand. No weapons. I don't know. Wow. The governor was pretty badass. I would say the governor. Me too. The governor um, was pretty badass. We really didn't see Negan fight. Yeah. He always has his bat. Yeah, maybe he's like, he can't fight at all. Yeah. He's an old man or something. I don't know. Yeah, but what we saw, like, the governor did shit. He really did shit everything on his own, and he didn't he did send himself his man. Too. Yeah, yeah, exactly. I think, I think the governor actually... Has anything big been spoiled for you guys about season 8 or 9? Uh, Rick leaving, that's all. Yeah, and that was, they announced it themselves, like, that wasn't even a spoiler. Yeah, exactly. Which was stupid, I think, but... Yeah. Never mind, just answered my question. Well, what do we do? Okay, I think we're so much, so, so, so far we're behind. We're behind, so. yay! But that's good, because people can actually, like, delete spoilers. Exactly. Thank, Thank you, you Mods. Thank you. Do you think Negan is going to survive or die in season? I think he's going to die. I think he's going to die. I think he's going to survive. He has to. I don't want him to die. Me, me neither. I hope they're not keeping him alive because the people want to. You know what I mean? No. no I hope no. they're actually having a story if for you, him then. Yeah, if his time comes and if his story ends, then please end it. But yeah. I would like for him to stick around a little bit longer. Shane Let's Rush, bag of head. That's <laughs> Negan leans at the same time. That's the perfect duo, yeah. I miss Merle. Oh, Merle. Merle would be great too, yeah. Oh, Merle was a great character, holy he shit. He was so good. Like, yeah. the couple of episodes we just had with him were legendary. Great, I forgot about him. Do you know when you start next season? I think we're going to start today. But uh, the episode, I don't know when it's going to come I'm sorry, out. sorry, there's something in my eye. Yeah, uh, we plan to do I hope at one least one episode. I mean, we plan to record at least one episode. Uh, you know, it will come... I hope one this week, but don't be mad if it's not because exactly. Let's say week, next week. This week was just know. for the Q and A normally, uh, but since we're doing a live Q and A, that's and, and I don't have to edit so much. I actually could imagine that I might do one episode this week too. So, let's see. Shane would have taken over and killed Rick. 
No, I, I think uh, it would have all come to the same situation. I think Rick would have outsmarted Shane because Shane was a little bit too much in the... You know what it I was mean? was insane. Yeah. In Shane. Is what in I mean. Shane, yeah. Sorry. Yeah. I don't think so. Andrew, thank you. I love your commentary and opinions. Thank you for your reactions. Thank you so thank much. Thank you so much. It's Killed great. The favorite heroes, I lost interest. Which ones? Favorite characters introduced in season seven. Season seven. Negan was introduced. Really. Negan was introduced. Dwight was introduced. Dwight. Really. Simon. 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 Uh, For me, it's Simon. Now I have to go with Negan. I mean, it's the obvious choice, probably, but I have to go with Negan. Yeah, I mean, Negan is always the obvious choice. But I think he was actually introduced already. Oh, characters. Yeah, okay, let's go with yeah. Negan and Simon. Negan, Simon. Yeah, definitely. Yeah. Well, what was your favorite moment or moments from the season? The finale, the last minute. That was cruel. That was hard. That was... Oh. That like, was that hit me like I never expected it to do. Um, if you watch the reaction again... I have to be honest... I uh, uh, Maggie's speech was like I was in the middle. It was rather long, you know. Yeah. And it was like around the middle. I was like, uh, "What is this?" And mm. then they focused on the watch, and I was like, "That's what it means." Mm. <laughs> you know, it was great. It was great. No, the whole speech was amazing, and, and it was and it was like really good, well done. But then, like, all coming together, and like just like the watch, the, the meaning, and then like all the words came back to your head when you saw the watch. <laughs> Oh, that like that hit me like a train. That, man. that hit me like a train, and I I'm actually proud of myself that I didn't like like really cried out loud there. That really hit me. That oh my god, like holy moly, I I, oh, I held it back so much, and you heard it when I tried to talk. I was just like, yeah, I was, <laughs> you know, I couldn't. Man, and it was, was a great oh. like departure for Glenn actually for the character. Yeah. It was a good because the way he went was just too quick, and there was no real inhuman. Yeah, there was no real and goodbye. You know, this was this the proper was this was it. departure yeah. of him. That was great. Uh, mo other moments. It's all comedic, really. Everything that Negan does, basically, like when they Eugene when they were first time there. That was amazing too. Um, Father Gabriel. <laughs> Jesus, what a lot of good things happened this season. This was so good. Um, the deer, of course. Best moment. I mean, the deer was bad, but I had honestly. You showed it to me back in the time, I back in the yeah. day, and I had it worse in my memory. Me too. Me too. I really think maybe they changed it. Maybe they improved maybe, yeah. it in the streaming version of the DVD. Uh, another good moment was when Negan cooked for Carl, yeah. and they were sitting like Negan was waiting, and suddenly like <laughs> I'm not waiting, I'm not anymore. waiting anymore. <laughs> It's too good. You know, these little things is always my favorite. It's so good. And people are actually mad at me yeah. because I like Negan. And yeah. I'm like, yeah, sorry. No, you like Negan too. What the fuck? I don't know. Because and he kills. And one moment too that actually blew my mind. Uh, the whole plan with Richard and Morgan. Like when Richard tried to sacrifice himself. Like this whole episode, how moment. it turned out. Yeah. Oh, that was so good. Well done. Like Richard made so much sense then and instantly killed. Yeah. Actually, I'm, 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 I was also hugely positive, positively surprised because I said Richard is my favorite character. Yeah. At the moment. I, I didn't mean it, of course, but he, he made so much sense. He's so He was so rational, and rational. if someone is rational, I can't disagree yeah. with him yeah, if because he's rational. He's being rational. Rational after a scene like this. Yeah. Like, just focus. That's amazing. That's amazing. I'm a fan of Logic, man. That was moral, but no bad assery. I know a word, but <laughs> yeah, I just still like him. Of course, I still like. He was him. human. Yeah, he was the typical human you yeah. would expect. Like he was, he was a more, you know, he was like Herschel, but not as badass as Herschel. Yeah, because Her Herschel yeah. was a little badass. Herschel was a, I don't want to say a better Dale, but he was a more fitting Dale and a oh, more geez, fitting yeah. moral, like compass for the group I yeah, think. yeah 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 um so i really miss i really miss him but i miss dale too i love i love them too 
Um, uh, gosh. Where who's else? your favorite saber, Lieutenant of so out of Simon, Gavin, and Dwight? Who is Gavin? Is it the guy with King Ezekiel? I like him. I like him. He's really trying. He's not a dick. Yeah. He's he just wants to get it over with with no problem. Yeah. But I mean, I gotta go with Simon. Simon, Simon yeah, thing. Simon. Just again, because he's like a half Negan, yeah. if that makes sense. You know, I would say Simon, Gavin, Dwight. What do you think will happen to Simon? I don't know. Survive. Yeah, I think um, if 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 I'm right and Negan will actually die in season eight, Simon will take over. Mm. And I think things will go a little bit different then, like with Simon. But I don't know. I actually don't know. I don't think he's gonna die or something. I think he's gonna survive. This yeah. Time. I love Negan's me too. Since you know Rick is leaving, who do you think will take the lead for our hero group? I can't imagine. Oh. I, I think Carl, probably, right? Carl has to. I mean. Like I he, don't see Carl as a leader. I do, actually. I do, because. I mean, we really didn't see a lot of him in this season. We we yeah. saw him, but but the way he acts, the way he is, if he's going a little bit more into the... If he, he's trying to be a little bit more rational and intelligent, like not going after Negan alone and trying, you know, if he stopped doing that, I think he's Rick 2.0. I think he's actually going in a, in a, in a good way, so... I, I can't say it right now, because right now he wasn't really... No, in this season included he included in any plans. But he didn't come up with any bright ideas. No, no. Uh, but but I sure, think, I think he could. Uh, I think he could. If he, if he, if he. No, I, I mean, I, I mean, I don't think he, he should be probably, but I think he will. You know what I mean? That's what I mean. Well, then they have to do it well, though, because you know he, they, they could screw it up so easily. Be, yeah, I think he will. Or who else? Michonne. Maggie, maybe. Maggie, yeah. But again, she would be just the plan, you know. She would just be the head, yes. uh, the brain of the of the group. Sure. Oh, that's uh, that's a leader. That's what a leader does. Yeah. Who else is there? I would say Glenn, buddy. I wanted to say Glenn, man. I'm still not over him. I don't see Glenn as a in a leader position. Oh, I do so so much. Glenn would be the perfect leader. He's a Glenn was a great foot soldier. Glenn was, I think Glenn would be in that. actually a better leader than Rick. But he just, just doesn't want it, and that's why he, he can't. Mm. I think actually... Can't he agree. Was. You guys are going to love season 8. Ugh, I don't we know. Had, we had so many different opinions. You're gonna, People say season 8 is the worst. worst People say it's the, the best. best. We're going to love it. We're going to hate it. It's all over the place. Let's see how it, it, it will It was the same with season out. 4, 6, and 7. So I don't even give a thing about this anymore. You know... I'm just going in like completely, okay, th what is this going to be? I'm not going to go into this saying like, okay, this is going to be shit. This is going to be good. I'm just going to let it surprise. Why is not a lieutenant? Yeah. Governor could be intimidating on his own, whereas Negan always has people to back him up. Yeah. But Negan is super intimidating. Negan doesn't need anyone. I no. mean, of course. The thing what Negan does is he marches into an area with weapons. I mean, where the enemy has weapons with an army. Yeah. That's the difference. Governor doesn't do that or didn't do that because he was actually more rational. Hey, Doc. Hi. Thank you so much. See you next stream. See it, dude. Everything that Negan does is for show. It's showing the power that he has yeah. and impressing people. That's why he always marches in with everything that he has. You think that Shane and Daryl would have been on the same page through the series? Let's remember that Daryl knew that what Shane did from the beginning. The difference was that Rick inspired Daryl to change. Hmm. <sighs> no. No. I don't think so. I think Daryl would... At some point, he would have definitely come to the conclusion that Rick is right. Yeah. Rick is doing the right thing. Because he's a, he's a logical guy, too. Exactly. Daryl is a rational he, person. He's very emotional, and you don't really see it because he hides it very well. But um, when it comes to logic, yeah. I think he's one of the best, actually. 
he would never do something that he doesn't believe in 100%, mm -hmm. I think. <clears throat> exactly. Who would win, Negan or the governor? The Negan. He has just too many people, you know? Yeah. I feel that even Shane would have been shocked if he saw what happened in the church of season 8. S season 5, sorry. No. He wouldn't have been what shocked. Happened he would in have season been five? proud. Like with the red machete, where he. This guy from Terminus, where they just just d killed them. Nah. Know. Shane, Shane would have be loved the, it. Shane would be the front guy who would do that. Yeah. Shane would have just. Or would have just uh, sat by and just like, yeah, that's my that's man. That's my wreck. <laughs> yeah. The Walking Dead is the dumbest zombie movie ever. It's uh, not a movie. It's a good thing because it's a TV show, so yeah, there we go. Do you think Simon is gonna die in season eight? Why is this quest? Is he gonna die in season eight? Why is this coming so much? No, I don't think so. I don't see a reason. Although when he gets ambushed, I mean, it could easily happen from one second to another. Yeah. Hmm. I know that it's. It's just for your info. I won a bunch of money playing the walking get slot machine at the casino last week. Do it. That's amazing. Congratulations. <laughs> Look. Walking Dead is doing so much good. <laughs> okay. I hope no spoilers. <clears throat> Such a bad movie, yeah. Yeah. A lot of people leave the show in season seven. Huh? Oh, okay. A lot of viewers probably. Yeah, okay. okay. I thought characters. Um, do you think it was so bad? No, I think... Um, we had the advantage of watching it. I think the waiting... Oh. And the slow pace of In, this yeah. of this uh, season. It was really slow pace. Some episodes were just. Yeah, oh. it, was, it was like the same timeline in three episodes, just different places. I think that's what people didn't like because they expected it to be, you know, action packed, yeah. like completely just like the struggle and everything. Mm. But so many different places, so many details. I loved it. Yeah, definitely. But uh, as like waiting for one week. To watch these, yeah. I think it would be annoying a little it bit. It was yeah. basically our choice to wait a week before yeah. watching, so it's different. Okay, uh, hey guys, what what do you think about if Negan was not killer? Rick is working with him forever. Like just like for the human part, like if he wouldn't kill people, I think they would get along amazingly. Mm. He would have been the same as Rick. Like that's the only thing that. Negan does yeah. different. He lives from fear, mm. and he does it by killing, yeah, or like intimidating into killing. You know, that's what he does differently than Rick. But other, he's the same. But uh, uh, if, if Negan wasn't like, if Negan wasn't Negan, then why would Rick work with him? It would be a you know everything that Negan achieved was because he yeah. killed and did er all that. Yeah. Without that, Neg no one would follow Negan, and Negan would be pretty. Maybe, maybe they would. That's that's what we don't know. So it you're would be saying a, that it would be another Rick, I think. There is more than he he's he's he is smart. Definitely. He is strong. He is like rational in a lot of moments. Mm. Um, he can be emotional. We saw that. Yeah. Um. The only thing that he really doesn't understand is that you, or that or that he wants to do is like living of fear and people following because you and that's fear you. yeah that's how he wants to get the world in order and that's you know a little psychopath but you know not a little a big psychopath that's i think the only difference between him and rick because rick killed people too um yeah mostly definitely. because they harmed his people definitely yeah or they needed to do it because otherwise they wouldn't have survived or mm. something um, but he did kind of the same but he didn't kill for fun or for intimidation or something he did mm. never do that Rick's the wrong guy for that uh, yeah what was the question what? <laughs> <laughs> but would he work would Rick work with anyone like okay. you help me I help you if there was no threat I don't know because Rick is at that point where he doesn't really trust people and he has to be the leader of hmm. something. I, I mean, they did it with, uh, with the Oceanside. Scavengers. Uh, no, with, no, um, 
the scavengers too, but that was like because they had no other choice. Exactly. Um, no, with the hilltop, they did it too. So I think they would actually. Mm, true. So yeah. Um, yeah. What do you think Eugene's story will go in season eight? I think he will actually be a great uh, savior. He will be one of the best saviors. Like he would be one of his top, top tier. Men. Yeah. Exactly. And then uh, at some point he's gonna face Rick and his group, mm. and he is going to have to decide. What is he gonna do? I don't know if Rick will accept him again. <sighs> yeah. I mean, you, for Eugene, it's all about survival. I think he, for Eugene, it is. It made the most sense to stay with him. Of course. And uh, I don't blame him for that. Like other people, I knew that from the start that he is like that and he told people he is like that mm. so you can't hate him for that really you know I mean you can but it doesn't make sense yeah okay um what do you guys think will happen with the trash people there we go the scavengers there are, I mean there are a lot of possibilities I think either they're going to go to them and wipe them out. Mm. Or they will join with Negan. Or they will actually work out something again. And will join with Rick. Which I don't hope. I highly doubt. Because that would be stupid. Yeah. Rick will not fall for um, that again. But now that they saw. Maybe they will actually try to come to Rick and say. Okay we're sorry we... You know, they saw how many numbers they have mm. and that they could actually do this. Ooh, excited. I'm excited about that. Me too. That's going to be a great uh, situation. Oh, yeah. Huh. Are you looking at the previous? No, I'm not looking at. We're not looking at previews or trailers as long as we can just watch the next season. Yeah. The deer is my favorite character of <laughs> season seven. <laughs> yeah. What's your favorite and least favorite season? Favorite. I hate least favorite because so far, actually, I loved all the seasons. Yeah. I think my favorite season would be. Mm. I love season four. Yeah. I want to say season four, too. Or season three and four, you know, a little bit. So the mixture, like 3B and 4A. Just love that. But that everything was good. Uh, so I, yeah, I would go with four, my favorite. Me too. Me too, I guess, yeah. Or maybe maybe one. I, I loved one so much. Six episodes, just perfectly. One or four, my favorite and least. I don't know. I can't say least. I, can, I never can say that. Maybe five. It's impossible. What was that? Like when they started to go to Alexandria. That was great. That was good. Very, very yeah. nice moments. But there was no real arc going on. No real enemy. No real. You know what I mean? Mm. So I think five my least. Even though it was good, I would say five. No. Yeah. Okay. What is your favorite moment of this show ever? When Ever. Rick bit out this guy's throat. Okay. That was my favorite moment of it all. That was great. That was just amazing. Or season one, episode two, or season, was it one episode? Yeah, the end. With the music, and then they were on the roof with Daryl, and you saw like the hand of Merle yeah. cut off. That was such a great moment. Oh my God. Season one in general was so good. That was amazing. <laughs> Oh man, the start. Nostalgic, man. Hmm. Yeah. But why were we? Up, 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 up. Up, up, up. What's up, going up. on? What is happening? Up. Are you kidding me? Yes. Where? Ah. Happy to someone enjoy season seven. I've not. I've seen so much hate for it. I think it's underrated, to be honest. Yeah. Me too. I 
I mean, as we heard so much shitty things about it. Yeah. And I can't understand. The same with season eight. Let's yeah. see how that will turn out. Uh, I don't know. People, I don't know why. Um, yeah. I think people expect too much. I think that's the problem yeah. these days. Or people are just like too. I don't know. Weak. They don't appreciate. They're weak. The d d details anymore. You know? They want a great story, but they don't appreciate the details yeah. anymore. True. Yes, that final minute of the finale and the finale shop for the watch was powerful. I could tell you were both touched by it. Spot on the other moments, too. I'll, I'll let the deer thanks again. The deer. Legendary deer. How has your year been so far? Okay, that was ad hoc. Okay. You, you guys talk. The mods talk. And right now we're answering questions from the chat. Yeah. So and it's been, it's been a while. And if the chat is like gone, we are we're 14 do minutes behind. Jesus Christ! Let's pick it up a little bit. Uh, two reactions per week, right? Yes, normally yes. And I hope two on early access too. Yeah, but I can yeah, promise yeah, yeah. you that sometimes one. But ooh, I like this do. question. What about Negan as the main lead of the show? It would be a great. It, it would be another perspective, really. And I I'd actually, appreciate I it. I actually could think about it when Rick is leaving that they focus on Negan. Yeah. And they go with him. Yeah. I'd appreciate it. Yeah. I would love it. Oh, that'd be cool. Kind of. Uh, what about an assembler type of approach after Rick's departure? Like a multi-protagonist type of show like Game of Thrones? Yeah, yeah, yeah. Negan, Maggie. I can't. I can't. I can't um, accept that. I can't accept who else, that. Who else? Like, Rick was there from season one to season nine then, mm. probably. I can't accept multiple main characters I need someone to replace him or the show is for me gone I, I actually say I that th nah, for no. me it's replace gone replace is a strong word because this was the whole idea of the show for me the whole time and that's what I always said everything was around Rick Rick was the main character everything was around him I never saw anyone else as main characters I always they were all like, always like uh, important characters mm. and like uh villains and stuff like that but the main focus was on Rick maybe Carl you know I don't know if I'm gonna I hope they're gonna do it a good in a good way I hope they're not gonna fuck it up yeah that's the thing yeah what do you think Negan would have been before the apocalypse how was he before the apocalypse I think he actually was a totally normal dude I actually could think that yeah and he, at some point I don't know why maybe we're gonna find out he, he went crazy and uh, uh, he probably he lost just, people. He, yeah, and he, he accepted like how it's gonna be, and he had so so bad experiences that he went into. The, you I'm, know, he I'm I'm pretty sure he lost people. He, he lost you know close people to him, like a like a wife, maybe maybe a child. Yeah. Um, to other people, and that's yeah. why he has become this. Yeah. Because he figured out that no other way is possible. Yeah. He had to be like this to survive. Because for him, you know, everything is a joke for him. He's become a cynic at this point. I think he wouldn't even care if he would die. Yeah. You know, he's trying to survive no matter what. But if he would die, he would be happy. I, uh, I don't know. Yeah, I'm not sure. Not sure. I can't really... I haven't that much insight into Negan yet. I hope we're going to get that in Season 8, maybe. Yeah, yeah. Um, Do you think Nisha could ever be reformed, given his backstory and how he, why it became yeah. what he did? Uh, yeah, I will never forgive him for what he did, never, ever. Uh, but I already love him, so give me a good reason to love him even more, and I will do it. But I will never forget and never forgive uh, what he did to Glenn. I really will never. <laughs> like, there are so many shows that I can forgive a lot of stuff, even deaths and everything, you know. But not with Glenn, not with Glenn, and Abraham, of course, not. No, nope. nah. I couldn't. I could never. I'm not that type of person. I'm sorry. I think I can. Yeah, I can go forgive a lot, but not that. You know, but you know, th see it from Negan's perspective. They attacked an outpost. They killed people. They did it before. I know. I can't say that. They always kill when they introduce themselves. What? They always kill before they introduce themselves. Who? That's what they saw. What they said. They did it with. Oh, they did it with uh, Hilltop too. The saviors and everything. Okay. So they would have done it either way, even if they wouldn't have attacked them. They wanted to get a great first impression. I don't think that would have mattered any in any you way. Know that, that, but that's an if. 
No, that's no, it's not. They would have. Can't know that. I can because they said it. Maybe in they'll every, lie. In every situation, they did it. I don't think they they lied there. They always they said it so much in season seven, like um, like we we would kill you just to give a great first impression and blah 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 blah. So they always do it, like with new groups. Missed that. No idea. Which character do you think has the coolest weapon? Michonne's sword, Negan's bat, or Merle's hand? Merle's hand was great. Merle's hand was amazing. It was great. That was so practical, goodness. But I'm for Michonne's katana. I like that. I actually am for uh, Rick's revolver. Yeah, it's unhandy. It's it's amazing. I you just love it. You have six shot, and it's, it's not. I don't it's give very a shit. loud. I don't give a shit. It's amazing. I would go for a crossbow, but reloading a crossbow all it takes time. How about a bow? Yeah. What about like a or a katana, hmm. like Michonne's? How do you feel Morgan will develop in season eight? He will go batshit crazy. Yeah. Kill everyone, I think he will anyone go, who will go lives. back to his roots, and go a little bit too insane, maybe. <laughs> Megan's a most interesting <laughs> character. He's not bad as you may think. You know the thing is. He uh, is. I don't I don't know if I'm about the misunderstood, but I don't think he's as bad as it is shown, actually. He is pretty bad. I don't know. He is pretty bad. <laughs> All the things he did. He's more a sociopath than a psychopath. Yeah, no. No. If he's both, but he's not more a sociopath. You know, he would be a sociopath if he would make the killing do from other people. Mm. But he does it himself. That's yeah, yeah, yeah. No, I mean, as a character, he's great, and I I like him, or I, I love him actually. But I think uh, <laughs> as a human being, he's not good. He's not misunderstood. Maybe he he doesn't. He has a backstory or something. But does that justify anything? For me, it doesn't. Like you know, what the fuck? Everyone has a backstory at this point. So come on. Rick, could. Rick lost his wife. Rick lost so many people. So, come on, what the fuck? Like Gav Governor had a backstory too, but did that make him a good person? Like everything he so did and it's everything not about that the person, huh? I think it's not about the person. Of course, didn't say it like. He's a misunderstood character. He's not so bad as you may think. He might have good intentions, but his way is not the best, man. His intentions are to survive and protect his people. Yeah. That's his intention. That's not a bad thing. No, but what he does is questionable, maybe. Yeah. Or dis yeah, just questionable. He's just not human, you know, in this moment. But then you can a ask, like, is that a bad thing, actually, in an in a, in a, in a apocalypse, meeting new people to be human all the time? He went. I'm, I'm certain he went through some shit to become like this. Yeah. Yeah. I don't give a shit. Negan? Oh, what? Do you think that Carol follows saving groups Rick in the next season? Yeah, definitely. Yeah. Carol's back. Definitely. Top three saddest deaths on the show and top three shocking deaths on the show. Jesus, I don't even know six people who died. I mean, I, mean, I can answer one for both. It's Glenn. Uh, yeah. Shocking and sad. Uh, Abraham was sad. You know when it was sad? Not in episode one, but... And uh, Sasha and yeah, uh, that yeah. was sad. Then it became sad. Yeah, you know, Abraham was a really cool guy, and it was it's a shame that he died. But that made it sad. It really made it, yeah. Um, Herschel. Herschel, yeah. Extremely sad. Not not shocking for me, but sad. Shocking. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Um, and shocking. one one other. I have my sads, by the way. It's Abraham. Yeah, I wouldn't say Ab not not like the most. Uh, Shocking. Beth. Beth. Beth was shocking. Beth was shocking and sad. My goodness. I, I was more sad f for M Megan. M Maggie. Maggie. Sorry. Yeah. That's still sad. <laughs> you know? I mean, I was sad for Beth, but when I saw Maggie, I was just like, oh, God. You Devastated, know? yeah. Yeah. Who else died? Who, what was shocking? How did the governor die? Can you refresh my mind? Michonne killed him with his katana. He was fighting Rick in, in the prison and Michonne put oh. a, the sword in his back. Shocking. Um, one more shocking. Shane. 
was really shocking for me the first time I watched it. Mm. I thought they're just gonna go back at this point. Really, I thought, um, mm. or I thought that he's gonna. D- I, d- I didn't think that he he was gonna kill him mm. in that moment. That was really shocking for me. Or, Laurie. <laughs> that was yeah. really shocking for me. Yeah. Okay, that's it. We can't we can't do too much because there's so many questions and we are so far behind. Yeah. Predictions for season eight. Uh, oh god. Ooh. Negan, I th- I said it. Nah. Um, one of the leaders, Negan. Gregory. One of the leaders. Gregory, Gregory will die. Gregory and maybe Dwight or Simon. No, I don't know. I have no idea. Maybe Dwight. Dwight seems um, like, like helping them or something. Yeah, exactly. Um, and ma- and one of the main group. I think. Like uh, Alexandria, Hilltop, or the Kingdom. One of the mains of them. What will Gregory do in season eight? He Die. will uh, betray Die. them so much and they will tell a lot of plans to Negan and uh, that will fuck something up. Uh, but uh, yeah. And then he will die. Where are we, man? Oh my god. Very, are you very, kidding very me? Very uh, 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 do you think Heath will ever come back? Oh yeah, <laughs> Heath exists. True, he drove away. What the I hell? I think he died. At this point, I think he died. And yeah. they will find probably maybe him with the with the, with the RV. Yeah, I really enjoyed season eight. Season eight B was so good. Okay, well we're not gonna listen to that. Most hated character so much- on the show so far, alive or dead, doesn't matter. Most hated. <laughs> Andrea. <laughs> Yeah, she comes she had close. She had her moments. But uh, I just didn't like her, man. I just didn't like her. I think because, yeah, I would I would have to agree. No one else comes to mind. No one else has the been that. The decisions she made. Yeah, stuff, exactly. Yeah. <laughs> that was a sad death, and they made me really feel for her, too. But, man, in general. Uh, You think that other characters come to season 8? Lose characters? What? I don't understand that question. I don't know. I'm sorry. So glad you finished season seven. What do you think of it compared to how everyone was shitting on it, saying it was horrible? I think that it was actually good because we appreciated it so much more. I don't know. I have sometimes I have the feeling we watch TV shows with a different kind of mind. Yeah. Than people, but I, I don't know. Hassan. Hey. Hassan. Hey. I uh, work with the audio open so I can't hear you, but saw yeah. you were alive, so I wanted to say hi. Thank you so much, man. It means a lot. I mean, you Thanks, won't man. hear this probably, but it means a lot. Uh, since we know that Rick will leave and that Daryl was a leader of action throughout the series, do you think that he will have a new partner in crime or that he will have to step up as a leader? Ooh, interesting. I mean, that's way in the future. We we're not even season eight yet. When is Rick leaving? Season 9, right? I think in so, In yeah. season 8, he's still in the show. I think so, yeah. Uh, uh, I don't... Daryl as a leader? I don't know. Hmm. Not as a leader, as... Please, please, uh, but, but, but guys, please don't talk about season 9 or, or 8. Please don't do it. Not at all, okay? He's Thanks. He's come... He would... He, not, no, he needs someone more than... He, he needs someone. Yeah. Daryl is not the guy to plan things or to make decisions. He needs someone to do that t- stuff for him. He's a great, great action guy. That's about it. You know that I had that in mind. That's a very good point. I had that in mind. But then again, he did that to prove... Uh, oh, sorry, m- maybe I should read the what chat first. You You'll come to realize Rick isn't very different from Negan if you look back through some of the things he did. Rick slaughtered an entire outpost easily, 30 to 60 people, and Negan started by killing two. In comparison, yes. I think it affects us because we just... You know, Glenn was there at the start. From the start. Yeah. He was a big part of the show, and that's why it affects people so much. Yeah. Um but uh, 30 people against two seems yeah. fair, right? But it's not like that. No. Not two people because we have seen not at Glenn all. and Abraham. No, I mean, I mean, we, we said it in season seven, I think, or in season six when they did it. Was that really, was it, is he that much different, you know? Um, but 
I think that was still something else. Um, yes, he killed these people, and but after seeing everything that they did, after seeing how they treated the people, after the, all the stories, after the pictures they saw and everything, how they bashed people's heads in and everything, all this stuff that was going on, I think you can kind of tell that none, none of them really were human at any point, so I don't know if they are actually... It would be the same. But oh, not again. I have a question. Why would Negan just not kill everyone then? Because he wants people to work for him. But he has enough people. The more the better. I don't know. It, it's more than that. I think he actually wants people to give a chance. He doesn't want to kill people blindly. The killing is just teaching them this is how it's gonna be. Either you, hmm. you know, decide to agree with me or you die. Yeah, no, no, of course. he wants. To, that's why he's, his people are called the saviors. They do want to save people. On their own way. Yeah, and by giving them order, by giving them, like, a place to live, by giving them protection. But they expect, expect like, unhuman things from them and everything, you know? And if they don't... And that's, that's what I mean. Like, what the fuck? Like, the whole system is just fucked up. Um, his idea is amazing and what he wants to do. But uh, the system is fucked up. It's just, like, crazy. The system is always fucked up. Yeah. Wise words there. Uh... Saviors mm. do always kill the... Can a case be made that approach prevents more widespread killing to more quickly educated groups? Uh... Yeah? Hmm, interesting. If a group would come and just be like, I want my group to be a part of your family. Yeah. We want to be Negan. Would yeah. he say yes? Would he accept it? Or would he still make, like... Kill people. I don't know. That's very interesting. Huh. I don't know. No clue. Group, what? There's a difference between closed people, Ivan Glenn, and mercenaries that Negan didn't even knew. The outposts had only soldiers, not families. You don't yeah. know that. They might have had families. No, I don't think. Yeah, yeah. But. But I don't actually think that. Uh, it doesn't matter, really. Is is a human more worth if they have a family? Yeah, but still, uh, you know, what, were these humans worth anything? Did they these fuckers like how many people did they kill? I, I don't think like you know, for me this whole situation was super fucked up, and everything with Rick. But when I saw like this this for example this 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 dude sleeping the and all these pictures with the Bastion hats, I was just like, what the fuck? Okay, just go on with it you know and I imagine like being a part of him and them trusting them with the outpost that they were all like that you know but I don't know that's always like the same thing uh, can you can you say that everyone is like that yeah. or some were forced to do it mm. no if we go deeper in this discussion we will get into you can't psychology go. we will you go into go. you can't go um, this would be, go too far yeah it will take too much time. But interesting to talk, really. Yeah. Uh, I know that Morgan is one of almost everybody's favorite characters, but I never really liked his categorical point of view. I mean, this black and white type of thing. What do you think on that? I agree, actually. I didn't like his way where he was like, killing is bad, I will not kill. It, yeah. It's stupid. It's not realistic. You don't Every, live... Everything has a gray area. You know, you, you, don't can, have to. you can be like that in this situation, in this system, in this world, but not in an apocalypse, it's just impossible or it's about survival. Even, even in the real world, it has its gray areas. You can't escape without, you know, every killing is bad. Yeah, what if you, you know, you can't, you can't. You have, you know, it's, it's simply impossible. It's impossible. It's impossible. Even the Dalai Lama, I think, said it one time, you know, like, I, I, I don't want to say too know, much. Yeah. Something about defending. I don't want to say too much uh, because I don't know what exactly he said. But even he said something like that. You know, it's it's simply impossible. Like, you know that. Uh, but okay. Negan is enjoying what he's doing. Yes. He's I, the guy that wanted to make Maggie one of his prostitutes in season seven. I will always love his character, but he's come. Exactly. That's a, I think that's a good factor. Negan is enjoying this. 
He really enjoys it. You see it. Or he wants people to think that he's enjoying it. I don't think so. I don't think so. I, he's at the point where he's really like enjoying all this shit. Then he has officially gone insane. He, I think he's insane. But he still makes sense in a lot of ways. Okay, it, uh, come on. Not, not more about Negan because this is going too, too far and we are already one hour... Um, we're following Negan from the stars, how we say blah blah blah. Last thing he was okay. Never said he was good, he's horrible. Okay, by no way, okay. No, okay, stop it with the Negan. I'm sorry, I'm sorry. It's gone too far, man. <laughs> what? Oh god. Oh Jesus. Oh, there we go. Okay. Uh, what, what is your favorite it? actor? Rick. What is and will Rick. always be. Uh, I mean, Negan is pretty new. He is also very good. I mean, Jeff Eden Morgan is amazing. Uh, Rick, Rick but uh, every scene. Uh, you know, the thing is, uh, <laughs> Negan is very good with comedic effects. He's the best. I think one of the best. Uh, but yeah. Rick's no, drama. Yeah, I think. It's I think Andrew Lincoln's Rick's, drama is Rick's, too good. Rick's struggle and the different characters he he's going through and the different emotions he's going through. We saw everything. We saw crazy Rick. We saw emotional Rick. We saw. Sad Rick, we saw everything, you know? Mm. And with Negan, we all, the only thing we really saw was scared Negan when he, like, at the end. Yeah. And just confident and intimidating Negan, mm. that's all. So if we see more layers, then we might actually, you know, I want to see more of that. Yeah, yeah, so yeah, yeah, yeah. Definitely. Then I can exactly. Definitely the other side of Negan. Yeah. More of that, please. Yeah. And then we can actually talk about acting. Sean did not kill the governor, actually. Lily Turk. True, too. yeah. Yeah, true. But you know, Nimshan could have. But yeah, I think, yeah. 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 Jeffrey Morgan is the best. He's good, yeah. Group was talking about it. Blah, blah, blah. Started on Vicky. It's not a spoiler. But okay. Be the process. Can the savers, meaning the foot soldiers, be turned from the dark side? Some of them, yeah. I don't think all of them. Yeah, uh, But definitely. some of them, I think, yes. I think not all of them are bad. Can you please react to season 8 trailer of The Walking Dead? Nah, I mean, we could, but we're still we're going to yeah, dive we in we have to, season. to season 8. Why would we? Now, to the... Okay. I, 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 haven't, I haven't read it, so... Okay. Uh-huh, 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 uh-huh. uh-huh. Where did the ocean side go from here? I think they will uh, not be in season eight for a while, and then they will kind of come to the rescue or something at one point. Do they have weapons? No. They are still hidden. I don't think anything will happen to them. Yeah, but I think they will come and kind of join them in like a situation where you think, okay, it's going up in a wrong way, or this, you know, they're going to lose, and the ocean side is going to turn up or something. And they will need yeah. people, and they will come to the rescue. Yeah. Nigga wants to save people in their mind is what is seen, but in the wrong way. Yeah. Mm -hmm, mm -hmm. I'm praying it what's uh, the villain. <laughs> <laughs> right, Ling? <laughs> uh, amazing. Uh, Philip! Is it Philip? Yeah. Philip? I, I guess so. You guys should try Fear the Walking Dead. First three seasons great. Fourth was awful though. Thanks for the spoiler. But season seven was awful apparently. Yeah, and, and season it. eight too. So, Let's yeah. see how well that will turn out. Going back to Miss Characters, I'm going to have to go with Fat Joe. What? What? I Fat didn't Joey. read it. Fat oh, <laughs> may you rest in peace. <laughs> 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 great. Oh, good Joey. stuff, man. So good. That's so good. Out of all the characters, who has changed the most in season one? I w I, I'm, I'm always, this question was always asked. I always say Rick, and it, it will always be Rick. It since will always be season, season one, one definitely. Because, he's yeah. one of the few that exactly, survived. Exactly, yeah. <laughs> all the change he's been through, <laughs> I have to say the Rick. But there's so much more. Uh, you can say Maggie. But no, Maggie was always kind of like that, you know? Did she really change? I don't think she changed a well, lot. She became more confident. Yeah. Like you become stronger, confident. More scareless. Yeah. Yeah. Uh, Breakfast, yes, yeah. Jared, and Rafe Jared. David. <laughs> I mean, you know, that's also a good point. Negan is someone who kills his own per people because of rules. 
No, yeah, like Crazy I said. Baby. Like I said, yeah. I think Negan walks to, uh, in that fine line that's between like insa- insanity and goodness. He's yeah. like, yeah, but he's, he's he travels yeah. that place. Yeah, exactly, exactly. It's like an like a roller coaster. Yeah. Where were we? Oh, we're almost caught up. Great. I'm so excited. Please make it fast. Okay, we will. Let's end it. Here. Those reactions. They aren't the protagonist. Okay. <laughs> okay, this is just a discussion from you guys, because we can't really go too deep into this. Really, it's it's crazy. I think that sees. Uh... Ria, hey, what's up? Yeah, hey. Uh, nah, it's okay, it's okay, it's okay. Group, it's okay. It's no problem. It's fine. It's uh, amazing. Do you agree with Maggie's statement that Glenn's death was not on Daryl? What? Um, no. Yes. What? <laughs> I agree, yes. Um, yeah. Of course, Daryl couldn't hold himself back. He hit I him. Mean, I mean, and it was a big no no. Yeah. Like Negan said. It's I unfortunate. It was, was kind of really. his fault, but it wasn't, you know. Yeah, yeah. Oh, jeez. Um. <laughs> We're caught up! Yay! Oh my god. Okay, we have some questions. Should we answer the questions that we yeah. have under yeah, the? Yeah, please. You're right. If there are still like, I mean, if you guys have still uh, questions, please, please uh, write them in the chat. Uh, but we have still questions in the. I'm going to have a walking that video. There you go. We probably answered them all. Uh, did no. you guys and did you guys enjoy Rosita's development throughout season seven? She stepped up big time. Um, she did, uh, but in the right way. I sometimes got annoyed by her. She was like, "This is gonna happen this way and this way and this way. Otherwise, we will not." It was a bit. You know, I, she wanted to... I loved her in in 7A. Like, all the all the things she did, and with the bombs, with re- everything, that was amazing. Very smart. But Very after cool. a while, I think she lost her way. After, after, um, after that, she just wanted to die. Yeah. And Suicide mission, yeah. Yeah. I don't know if that's stepping up, you know? But yeah, she... she Definitely, yeah. Came to her senses in the end, and... It was, yeah... I like Rosita. I don't. I don't hate her at all. Would you become Negan if you were asked to, to like Eugene, or would you resist like Daryl? If I would have people that I care about, I would try to resist, of course, as long as I can. But if I don't have anyone, I would definitely become Negan. Um, depends on what kind of position. If I'm uh, gonna be in a position like Eugene's, definitely yes. Yeah, yeah, no. I mean, if I have like family and everyone, and that I people that I really care you know, about. No, I would try. It's impossible to resist like Daryl. Nothing will happen. Nothing will come out of it. Yeah. But if you pretend no, w- to w- be w- Negan, yeah, I, I would, would pretend. Yeah, yeah, of course. Pretend. Maybe, yeah, maybe. Unless I have no one. No, if, if I probably join. If, if I would be in the same situation as, as Daryl and I do it, thinking about someone else, about Glenn, he can't because he thought about Glenn. Yeah, I mean Daryl's yeah, course, I position is resist. really fucked I mean, up. It's, it's crazy. Yeah. But yeah. This is more a statement than a question. Okay, that's all about season seven. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Okay. okay. Death uh, predictions for season eight. We, t- we said we it. Said we it. said it. We said it. Request from all new, all the new communities. Jesus from Hilltop. Um. Yeah. Shiva from. <laughs> yeah. Good point. And no. uh, Negan from. So yeah, of course. What are we gonna have next season for Negan? We talk I about it so he's much. Die, but I'm, 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 yeah. I don't know. Which dead characters from previous seasons would you see being useful on the Savior's arc? Shane. <laughs> He's gonna come back. But he, would he? No, I think he would go too crazy and I think he would fuck mm. up a lot of shit. Herschel. Herschel would be great, yeah. 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 What do you think about Eugene development in the season and his final? Great. Great. Amazing. Amazing. Uh, I'm sad that people get angry at that, <laughs> which is sad, really. Nothing Guys, more than sad. I don't think if you would, would be in his position and he, yeah, you wouldn't do anything else. Exactly. You can't. You just can't. 
still still discussing. Amazing. That's cool. That's okay. Um do you guys think that Eugene will stay loyal lo loyal loyal to Negan? Yeah. As long as he as is in this position, yeah. he has this power, yes. Yeah. Definitely. Because he's oh music. <laughs> music is over. It's empty. Um because he's being treated like he's never been treated before. Yeah. At least in the apocalypse now. And yeah. that's something that he missed, I guess, being valuable. In season seven, episode 15, do you think Rick went the right way taking Oceanside? Of course. Yeah. He definitely. I mean, he could have gone so much harder on them. He did the perfect thing. He didn't kill anyone. You know, that was amazing. Definitely. So well done, well executed. Rick's morals questions. Rick Mollers. Guys, they, you know, they had to. Without mm. the guns, nothing would have worked. Yeah. And they yeah. actually, they actually tried to, 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 you know, did them fight with them, but they didn't force them to. You know, they said, okay, if you don't want to fight, then okay, but we need your weapons. Yeah. It was also like, uh, yeah. Rick is a terrorist for that action. No, not at all. If you're from another group, which camp would you join, Negan's or Rick's? Ricks, because Rex. I would definitely Rex. not go for Negan because I would have the fear that I would be killed. <laughs> there is that possibility. Yeah. A Q&A or two ago, I asked which character would you be least upset today. You both <laughs> answered Sasha. Would you have that's, done that? That's, that's, Sasha did just to get cruel. an attempt to kill me. Would you have done what Sasha did just to get an attempt to kill me? No. No. I would have waited on that roof yeah. for a clean shot. I don't know why they did not. What was, what was I don't holding know. them back? You know, Sasha always claims she's a great shot, and she is a great shot. She's a great sniper, but then yeah. she just... It it doesn't make sense if you think about it. It's yeah. annoying a little that bit, too. stupid, yeah. But, yeah, I, well, I can... So how did she pass. even know whom to attack, and why did she attack a random... Bu yeah. You know, I, I had I the was same to, idea. I wanted to talk about that. And I didn't like, give a shit about it, because, after all, there's a TV show. But... And I guess... Maybe, maybe... That, she could sense it. Cats, kinda. exactly. Cats are smart, you know? Because they are, yeah, yeah. Yeah. I mean, they're not dogs, but still they have brain and much smarter than most people give them credit for. Or she actually just attacked people who were threatening, like, her people. Her, yeah. That makes sense, definitely. Yeah, yeah. Okay, that's all the questions for here, too. Guys, I think we're at the end, or do you have still a lot Questions here. Goodness, I don't even know. I doubt it. Uh, uh. Okay, guys, I guess that's it. I mean, we have yeah. the music, so there's really no <laughs> point to re to stay here. Um, yeah. I hope you enjoyed this live. We didn't want to do this too know. long, and uh, we had great discussions. Uh, we have interesting discussions. Uh, sadly, we don't. I mean, we're not gonna do this like two, three hours like we used to do it in Game of Thrones. No. By the way, there is stupid. still a Q and A missing in Q. <laughs> do you still have that? It will never come. No, I deleted it. Okay. I, it went got. It went when I when my computer broke yeah. down. Sally. Uh, thoughts on episode twelve? Convos with Rick and Michonne. Oh, I um, need more than that. When they talked about not, they can't lose each other, or they can lose each other. It was a good. Dis uh, what a, was a good talk. I think I really sure. enjoyed it. I guess if it was. Um. <laughs> Yeah, that's all. <laughs> next week starts season eight. Probably, maybe this week, but definitely next week, yeah. How do you feel about Gabe compared to previous seasons? Great. Good guy. Very cool. He, I think he found his real way. Yeah. Um. You're the best. Thank you. You're the best. And guys, Thanks. we have to end it here. It's one hour. We didn't want to do that long normally, but it was awesome. Cool discussions. Thank you so much for watching. Thanks, guys. I hope you enjoyed this Q&A, this live Q&A. If you have any improvement ideas, please post it under the comments, which will be under this video because we will make it public soon yeah. after it is done processing. Thank you guys so much again and uh, yeah, see you uh, next week in Goodbye. the next Walking Dead episode. Bye, 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 bye. bye. bye.